no way. If friends offered me a nice, cushy office job. I didn't think we had any new miners on account of the positions being full up. Ah, okay, okay, so that was you, huh? That's great. I was just saying how much better the new stuff is. Works like a dream. Thanks. Anyway, I'm Leila. When I'm not mining, I'm tinkering with Gnome, our unofficial mascot. I fill that computer brain of his with all sorts of nonsense and announcements. Of course. If you're here to chat, I'm always happy to talk shop. Especially if you're interested in talking about the heart of Mars. Yeah. Gnome's been down here forever. He's also been broken forever. Can't actually walk or do work, and we don't have it in the budget to fix him. No one's had the heart to junk him, but when I started, I gave him new purpose. I programmed him to tell us local news and announcements. I modeled his responses after my own sarcastic sense of humor. It proved to be popular, so I did what any aspiring comedian would do and gave him a bunch of stupid jokes to tell. People love it. Or at least that's what they say. <laughs> Very funny. Who sent you to ask? Was it Rivka? No, she seems to know what she's doing. I bet it was Hank, wasn't it? He always acts like he's top dog, but we all know he couldn't mine his way out of a wet paper bag. A little. Look, I don't like to speak ill of the dead, but Hank was a special kind of jerk. But it does sound like the sort of thing he would ask someone to do for him since he was so self-conscious about his own performance. Oh well. Sometimes the trash takes itself out, I guess. This is only my second contract, so I think I've been here for, what, uh, four years now. It's great. I love it here. I'm working on getting those red eyes that are all the rage these days, you know. You'll hear a lot of these other chumps complaining about Sidonia. They say it's boring or dangerous or whatever. Look, I come from an ice planet. These people have no idea what they're talking about. Sidonia is practically paradise compared to where I grew up. Why? I mean, who wouldn't want cool blood red eyes? It's kind of a badge of honor thing around here. People know your hot stuff when you got red eyes. Also, it freaks people who don't know about them. Except for little kids. They always seem to think it's awesome. Either way, it makes for fun social gatherings. Oh, so you're interested in the heart of Mars, are you? Word is there's a cave out in the Martian waste with a gleaming node of the purest titanium ore you've ever seen. It's worth quite a lot of credits, but some say the heart of Mars is cursed. Hundreds have gone in search of it, never to return. And every one of them met a grisly fate. Maybe, just maybe. Could be the first to succeed, though. You know, if you think you got what it takes. No judgment if you're too scared. What? No. I mean, maybe the cursed part isn't real, but who am I to say? Look, I told you what I know. You can either choose to believe me or not. All I can say is that if you manage to find it and avoid the curse, You'll be a legend around here. Because in Roman mythology, Mars was the god of war. His heart is cold, but tough like titanium. One of the miners started calling it that long ago, and the name stuck. Seems fitting enough. Fair question. I'm not really the adventurous type, to be honest. And frankly, I don't need the money. So, I don't really feel the need to involve myself with the prospect of a potentially deadly cursed chunk of titanium. That's the spirit. 
You sure didn't seem like the type to be scared off by tales of cursed rocks. I'll give you the coordinates for the cave. Good luck out there, and be careful. Hey, see you around, I guess. Learning to accept the truth of higher power.
know why they call this the Red Planet? Because it's not the moon! <laughs> Thank you. So glad they're stocking the drink cooler with more options. And Rivka said it was a dumb request. Who's dumb now? What? Hold on. You're telling me you actually found the Heart of Mars? It's supposed to be harmless prank we send newbies to go find. It's not supposed to actually exist. Yet, here it is. Or at least something resembling the legend. The only way this could happen is if... Damn it! If I gave you the wrong cave coordinates. Well, whatever you found, it's still impressive. You showed me up on this one. Feel free to keep it, since I'd say you earned it. Ooh, working the deep mines, that's where you make the big bucks.
thought we had struck oil, but it turns out it was just another deep water deposit. That would have been wild. We have the tech to instantly jump across the U. Brennan's treating you right. You're definitely someone worth having around for tricky situations. Hey, get that! Hope Mr. Brennan's treating you right. You're definitely someone worth having around for tricky situations. I'm here to help if you need anything.